Hello and welcome to Lakewood Chevrolet. My name is Brett and this is a pre-owned certified 2006 Chevy Silverado 2500 HD diesel in Summit White. Now underneath that hood, you have the 6.6 .6 liter V8 Duramax diesel, the iconic, the infamous, made for tough jobs such as hauling and has a payload of 3,318 pounds. But I've been standing in the front a little too while, too long here. I'm gonna show you the front headlamps. As you can see, they are vintage as well as useful with the side of the square body and all of the reflectors and high discharge. And at the bottom there, you have the daytime running lights as well as there are two recovery hooks. And we finish with the chrome work grill of 2006. And as we go this way, the first thing you will notice is the 17 inch steel wheels with the Chevrolet logo. They are load bearing and they are great as well. As you can see, a part of the undercarriage as we walk on by, the mirrors are powered and they have turn signal indicator. There is a nice chrome sidestep right there with two grip ports as well. As you can see the trim of the old school 2500 HD four by four, yes. And you also get some mud flaps there, some heavy duty and they hook up well with this trailering package here and all of the electrical ports that you need in a nice chrome case. And this is the Silverado tailgate. As you can see, it is nice and clean as well as you can lock it for your safety. There is a lot of thefts nowadays. You can never be too sure. And the back is covered with a true export hard top cover. And there is one more look at the chrome bumper. As I finish my tour, this vehicle is made from the classic Chevy steel framed. So it is tough and durable and almost puncture proof. Well, I'm going to get inside. I'm going to let the diesel warm up and show you around on the inside of this certified 2006 2500 HD diesel. And as you can tell by that noise, the diesel has started to rumble. That diesel noise here is great. It means it's been tried and true. I just wanted to show you the signal indicators on the rear mirrors before I begin my journey from left to right down below. You have all of your automatic windows, doors, mirrors, and locks. And right beside the steering wheel, you have all your automatic light options. There are a plenty. And here you can go from two wheel drive all the way to four high, four low in the press of a button and here are some customized treats for you as well on the dash and to accompany that you've got the cell phone holder and it twirls so you can google maps it or whatever you need to do to drive you got the tap and tow by the steering wheel and i'm going to focus on the steering wheel it is a hard black nicely stitched with all of your amenities right there as well as there are some driver option screen options down here below and I'll come right back up here and show you all of the voice. Now, here is the driver information screen. It is rather large with a lot of useful information on it, as well as there is the odometer. This is a certified pre-owned vehicle, but it has a big heart and a lot more to give. Here's the entertainment system. We're not used to seeing this in nowadays cars, but it works nonetheless. There is your DV or CD player, your tape deck. So get your poison tapes out of the shoebox and start playing them while you are on the road as well as this is quite a nifty climate control package as well as there is air conditioning i believe in here as well as circulation and tons and here is some more goodies you've got the series satellite radio right there in convenient with all of your attachments you have the remote as well as you have the other part of the screen and just in case you want something from the past will give you the ashtray you can take that out though this vehicle also has a great gripped mat right on the armrest and you just pull it up i do believe and you will find oh right over here and you will find that it opens this way to give you quite a convenient storage space to put all of your handy dandy stuff in here is the upholstered seat right next to me it is soft it almost feels like a fleece blanket it is comfortable as well as great lumbar support there and I'm just gonna show you a bit of the door, but I won't be able to show you that much with the glare, but there is one Bose speaker. You got the double glove box, and I'm just gonna direct your attention up to the 
rear view, you can see it shows the temperature and the direction as well as there is a temperature control on the mirror and you've got all of your lights as well as a nice cubby hole. And the last thing I'm gonna show you is I'm gonna pull this down to show you the visor and you've got more, you've got the retract the visor as well as the classic blue tint up there to cut down on glare. Well, there is another row, so I'm gonna jump back and show you it. Before I jump in the back, I just want to show you the cover of the box, nice and glistening in the sun. And if you can't make the step up, there you go, there is the chrome step assist. And as we jump into the back, you can see that the comfort continues. This looks like a rabbit's den with all of the nice fleece right at your fingertips. This is a bench style seat. And all I gotta do is go like this and lift it up and you can actually store stuff underneath and make way more room. And that one goes up and around as well, I was gonna say up, but it also goes around and in here, I'm guessing this will be the beverage tray. Let's open this down. You've got the nice plush beverage tray there. I just thought thoughts of a teddy bear when I felt that that is how comfortable this is and you've got all of the tint anti-glare high ceilings and a lot of space on the bottom as well as nice mats and there you go is some radio controls in the back and that pulls down as well into another beverage tray you got the magazine racks you will be snug as a bug with this soft interior I'm gonna give my last looks on the other side so just pay attention And I just wanted to give one last sweep look and mention that the driver's side is an automatic powered seat and it works divine. There is a lot of leg room in this classic workhorse. 2500 HD from 2006. You've got the old school trim right there. It has seen a lot of days on the field, but it is geared up to see quite a bit more. Where can you find this workhorse? Where in Edmonton? Well, you come on down to Lakewood Chevrolet on the corner of 34th and 91st. I'll even leave it running. We'll hop in, take a test drive, and you might just be galloping home in your new workhorse 